aliens, monsters, ghosts, and more. Anything can happen in the swamp. This is Swamp Stories. On tonight's episode, three friends have a terrifying encounter with an elusive creature known only as the Helligator. This is their story. Well, it all done happened about three weeks ago. I was out drinking beer on the porch with my buddies, Daryl and Clyde. If there's one thing I do remember about that night, I was, I was definitely drinking beer. Well, 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 I, I remember we were sitting out there down on the porch and then all of a sudden out came this sound crawling out from the, coming out from the swamp. It sounded like a ray gun. Nyo ping, nyo ping. No, now listen, it was not like that. It was more like, and I sounded something a little bit closer to it, like a, come on now. No, it was more like, hey now, ahooga. Fifteen percent off TJ Maxx. It sounded like, <laughs> and that's when I knew it was the Helligator. Yeah, see, 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 not a the, well, the Helligator has got a got quite the legend around these parts. See, everybody knows about it. M -m -m Mama used to say, "Y'all beware the Helligator." Now, there's two things I know in this life. One, it, the Helligator is real, and two. All right, so the sound of this helligator spooks the dogs, right? They start howling like crazy, and I just want to shut them up. So I yell to uh, Clyde over there. I say, hey, Clyde, bring me my guns, baby. And bring Daryl another beer. Well, don't mind if I do. See, 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 see. Now, Mama mama used to always say, uh, a drunk with, with a gun is about as, 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 as useful as two p p p peckers on a priest. Next thing I know... There's a rustling in the leaves and some splashing in the swamp water. And then I hear, pow, pow, pow. Yeah, I did you all on the porch. But I was nervous. And like I said, I was drinking. I says to my buddy Daryl, I said, we better get over there and start to investigate. Be like them detectives on TV, like Ice T. I ain't never been much of an Ice T guy, but. I am a beer blower, plain and simple. So we head out to the swamp with our guns and our flashlights, just like in college. And beer. Can't forget that now, can we? <laughs> and there he was, right in front of our eyes, the Helligator. All slimy, slithering around with scales and goo, as big as a bull. Scared the crap out of me. And then, out of nowhere, I smell this smell, the stinkiest voodoo doo-doo smell I ever smell. Mm. I did not shit my pants. That is yet to be proven. Well, we all found Daryl's shitty pants out by the, by the creek the next morning, so honey, it's already been proven. So I shined my light on that there alligator and he slithered on out of there fast as a Ferrari on a Friday, never to be seen again. Do I, do, do I think Daryl has a drinking problem? They were trying to come at me. I said, oh, stop telling me what you're doing here. And I was just trying to eat a Virgo first, and they showed me. Yes, Daryl has a drinking problem. Where's that alligator now, you ask? Well, I personally think he's still out there, and he's plotting his revenge. That alligator is one mean voodoo doo doo motherfucker, and I ain't gonna let him get away with it neither. This concludes tonight's episode of Swamp Stories: Finding the Alligator. Tune in next week for more stories from the swamp. Well, forget about the 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 the, the alligator. Daryl is filled with so many kinds of problems and, 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 and neuroses. He, 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 he's such a, a lightweight. He, 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 he never actually finishes a beer. He just enjoys the sound of opening them. God damn that, Daryl. You know, sometimes I think he likes the smell of shit in his pants. He likes that warm peanut butter sliding up his crack into his, into his, into his belt loops. 
Sometimes, so, 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 sometimes, Sunday, Sunday football, he, 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 he has a bad habit of halftime dragging his butt along the carpet. Stop d- dragging your ass along my carpet. You're leaving a sh- Shit stain on my carpet, Daryl. Uh, but b- b- how is am I gonna clean my 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 my, my booty hole? It ain't no go. You just say just say, use it like a, a, a toilet paper, like a normal person.